Today, we're here to ask and answer one simple question, how to move my crypto off of Uphold and into another wallet. So this is attempt two of this video since I forgot to unmute my microphone during the first recording. So second time's the charm. So this is going to be the main screen of Uphold. All the funded crypto that you have is going to be over here. And basically in the right over here is where we're going to be either buying, selling, or transferring our crypto. So over here, we are going to hit select network and we are going to pick Solana for this specific video. Over here, we are going to hit destination and you're gonna see a couple things. So if you take a look in the top right over here where it says my accounts, like you see Shiba account, Shiba account two, these are accounts that were recently interacted with. If you scroll down a little farther where it says crypto, this would be if you wanted to sell the previous screen's crypto, which was Solana into Bitcoin, into XRP, into Ethereum. A little farther down would be crypto networks. Keep in mind guys, if you're going to be sending a cryptocurrency, it has to be on the correct network. And what I've learned when toying around with this over the last day or so, cause someone did message me saying they were having problems getting their Shiba Inu over to Coinbase. If you end up sending Shiba Inu, select the ether option and it will end up sending it over and it will be received into the Ethereum wallet. Also keep in mind guys, during a bull run, gas fees on Ethereum can get quite expensive. I ended up only receiving 71 cents out of $4 that I sent. That's between the uphold fee, which was 99 cents, the $2.05 uh, $2 5 fee and gas fees. So I only received 71 cents. I think at the current value, it's like 75 cents. Okay, with that explanation out of the way, we are gonna come up here to destination just cause it's easier to find Solana this way. We are gonna type Solana. We are going to skip this first one because this again, under crypto, will just basically send it to a second Solana wallet here on Uphold. We are going to scroll down a little bit till we see Solana Network. Once we see Solana Network, it is going to ask us for the amount. We are going to send max. So what I'm gonna do now is come up here to Coinbase, pull up my Solana wallet, hit copy address and come back over here to uphold. Now we are going to tap preview withdrawal. Now it is going to ask for our address. We are going to type it in. Normally you wanna double, triple check, make sure this all matches up because if you send it to the wrong wallet, if you miss one digit, odds are you're not gonna get your crypto back. So now we're gonna hit confirm. Over here, this is what we want to take a look at right now. Transaction preview. From Soul Wallet, network fee. So over here, it is saying the network fee is at $4.12, which is quite expensive for Solana. On screen, I'm going to pop up a transaction I did about two months ago with Solana, the last time I really sent anything, and it was tremendously cheaper. It was less than a penny to send what I had to send. But for the sake of the video, we are going to hit confirm withdrawal. Now it's going to ask me for my code, which we are going to type in. Then it's going to load. It's going to take a couple minutes to load. It doesn't take too terribly long. Transaction is processing. Until we complete this process, your transaction will show as pending. Thank you for your patience. So we're gonna say, okay, got it. And at this point, it is just a waiting game. Again, guys, be careful when sending money, especially with certain cryptos like Ethereum. Gas prices can get really, really high, and you don't wanna lose out on a majority of your funds just from getting it from one place to another. If your gas fees are expensive with your current cryptocurrency, you can always try to move them into a different crypto on the site and try sending it that way to hopefully cheapen the price a little bit. All right, guys, a couple minutes later, we are back on Coinbase and $4.15. 
Again, relatively big gas fee for Solana right now, but we did it for the good of the video. Hopefully you did like this video. Hopefully it was helpful to you. If you do like this video, like, subscribe, leave a comment, take care, spike your hair, and I do hope you have a blessed day. Peace.